We're being held at this signal to allow the least eastbound train to pass through a clearance to proceed when the signal clears. Okie dokie. Hi, oh yeah, dead here. Welcome back to Crane Cane Creek. Crane Crane Creek. Crane Creek. We should be doing this actually. TSW2. There we go. All good. There's a little coat hook. Not sure what that does. Don't really need. Ooh. Oh, we've got an air conditioner. Cool. Nice. Let's do that. No. Okay, thank you. So we just told it a red. Uh, power handles idle. Forward is into forward. Oakley doakley. Uh, oh, no light. Definitely want them on. Don't want the back headlights on because that's weird. Oh, we haven't got a second person or is even a second man or even a second woman. Uh, say hello. Wave, everybody wave. Can't wave. There's no VR. Oh, he's got three locos. Check him out. He's fancy. Right, what we've got, break 54%. Okay. So yeah, so this is the second of the two, um, is it tank car set outs or something? This is the second of the two um, shorter of the uh, wow, that cleared pretty quick, didn't it? Oh no, wrong way. Sorry, you did probably about four. Give us a bit of power, get us going, and then fingers crossed. Wait for the power to come up. Um, but yeah, second of the two sort of slightly shorter scenarios just to get the journey going again a little bit. Take it all the way off, fingers crossed. That one's off, all good. Oh, check that out. Oh, not check that out. It always seems to take a couple of goes to get these trains going, and I don't know why. I don't, physics just doesn't seem right to me, but what do I know? Okay, let's try that. Right, cut, cut the power, cut the power, cut the power. Right, independent brake is released. The automatic brake is the one we were using, so let's keep that one on, and that's all we got. Clear there's no direct brake. Right, so let's try that again, shall we? Put it up to four, maybe five then. Perhaps we need a little bit more to get us going. Wait for the power to come up. Now that's that's good, that is, look at that. Release it, all in one shot. No signs of wheel slippage. We could put a little bit of sand on. Where's the sandy button? Bit of sand. Do like a bit of sand. Come on. More power, maybe. It really shouldn't be taking this much. Come on. It's sort of going slowly. It's very weird. It's all juddery. Right, let's just ease it back a little bit. We are moving now, so that should... Uh... Okay, I think we're all right. Just, yeah, I had real problems with it during the stream I did. Just getting, the, getting it going, you know? It seems to take a heck of a lot of effort. I mean, we, we've got a 1% downhill gradient. Gravity is on our side, and still the train didn't want to start. It always seems to take a couple of goes. Oh, look, there's a water, water thingy. I did do a few, um, few of the old collectibles at the end of the stream last time. I had a potter about. Started doing some certain windows. Oh, look at that. Letting some of that lovely morning air. Nice. Right, what we got? 30 mile an hour limit coming up. So let's drop a little power. Because now we are going, there'll probably be no stopping it. Yep, it's still creeping up. Well, that's not going to help, is it? How can we got that on? No, stop it. Why am I not braking? Hello? Yeah, I don't, all this jerking about the train's doing, it's a bit, wow, look at that. It's not right. I swear there needs to be an update to this. I'm no expert and I'm not one to I very rarely want to criticise at all, but this, to me, feels really, really wrong. That looks quite smooth, that looks alright now. Let's give it a bit of power then. Let's 
course gets up to that 60. Four miles to Brendel passing siding east. We've got a yellow in 1.7, so we need to keep a bit of an eye. Bit of an eye. I still think it looks great though, there's no question. I mean it's just it just gives such something different to everything else we've had before, even the you know the other big sort of US great service type stuff just the environment's completely different so 2.2 miles we're still at 60 over the lake i'm probably not going to need that so you're not much to get rid it's cluttering up All sorts in here, all sorts of different colours, a couple of different types of uh, car. Let's start the power down because uh, it'll take a minute for it to dissipate. Right, let's catch up. Gravity's still carrying us down a little bit. Right, one and a half miles to that 60. Still got a yellow signal coming up. So let's keep a bit of an eye out. 2.8 miles to our go via even, let alone anything else, just to go via. Right, we are losing a little bit of speed, but we've got a 1.4% gradient. So I'm gonna keep that brake on. In fact, I'm gonna increase it because it's not doing that much, has to be said. Right, okay, now I'll let it go. 0.4%, 0.1%, not so bad. It's a flashing yellow, that can't be good. What we got else? Another two miles, still a yellow, okay. 0.8 miles to the 60, but we're cruising along nicely at 55, so I think we'll stick with it. Oh, gaining again, 1% down bubble. Uh, ooh, a bit rough. over the brake just to wash some of that speed off it's very jerky I seem to be being thrown about quite a lot which I'm not used to it doesn't seem quite right uh, but anyway it's all right we're holding at 54 miles an hour 0.9 percent down bubble still got our 60 and 300 yards still got another yellow signal 1.3 1.6 miles to go via we've lost a little bit more speed so i'll um ease the brake off a little touch uh, 52 okay fine but back to a one percent gradient again okay 51 1.2 one mile 30 miles an hour and gravity is not our friend so uh, we need to keep that in mind. Ooh, and see, no brakes. Why did that suddenly do that? It's just a bit, like that, you see, it's just a bit weird. Anyway, we're starting to gain speed. So let's try and wash a bit of that off, actually. Because I have no idea how long it's gonna take us to stop. Or not stop, but slow down to the 30 mile an hour limit we've got. Quite a lot by the look of it. Full service, barely taking any speed off, barely any at all. Got a thousand yards to lose 20 miles an hour. Oh no, now it's dropping. It's flattened out a little bit, that'll help us. We're not in a rush, it's freight. There's no particular time we need to be there. I'm still slightly concerned we're not gonna hit that 30. But we are getting there slowly. Actually, we are dropping now. Might just make it. Might just make it. Right, red signal, 1.2 miles. Okay. So I'll release the brakes. See what it does next. So 100 yards to our 30. Still losing a bit of speed. But you know what? We've got a red signal coming up. I'm going to play this cautious. It took us best part of seven or 800 yards. Ooh. 15 miles an hour. 
okay, so let's have a little bit more of that then. I'm glad that I kept us well under that 30. We're actually starting to gain speed despite the fact that I just put the brakes on. Physics all a bit weird. Really, really, really all a bit weird. Come on. At least at slower speeds, your 400 yards takes a lot longer and you've got more time to slow down. We could probably risk doing that, to be honest. Drive past the third siding and stop as indicated. Okay, dope. Okay. Sounds A-OK -okay to me. Be helpful if you indicated the stop, but I'm assuming that means we're all right for a minute. Where are we? All right, hey, one. All right. Apparently that's the third siding. I, I'm not sure why that's the third siding, but still. Right, sorry, I wasn't paying attention to my speed. Let's try and get down to that 15. Nicely done, thank you very much. We're on nice, no, stop it. Behave. We're on nice level ground, so there was no reason for you to suddenly jump back up to 15 miles an hour. Look at that. Look at the accelerometer thingy, whatever that's called. Oh, look, there's one of those sign things. See, that shouldn't be happening. I, the brakes are off, there's no power. The loco's doing all sorts of funny things. Very strange. Anyway, we're all right. Right, stop at location, 400 yards. Okay, oops. A nice picture. Better picture than that. I left it too late. Never mind. Right. Uh, we got 250 yards. Okay. It shouldn't take an awful lot to slow it down from here. Let's just keep it under control. So control is not something I'm feeling right now with this train. Has to be said. Because it, it reduces speed and then suddenly it shoots forward again with the same brake pressure. I mean, that really shouldn't have been that difficult. Stop the blooming train. Seriously, stop. You can stop now. Good grief. Split the train behind the first five tank cars. We must then spot these on the stub track next to us. Spot them? I can see them! No idea what that means. Okay. I think we're going to leave them there. Uncouple 30 vehicles. Okay, oops. So yeah, it just done, you know. Mm, physics, not happy. Uh, right, of course I took the thingy off, didn't I? That was a bit silly. Always gets more entertaining. Thirty yards? Ah, right, okay. So behind these ones then, right? That looks about right. Let's do that then. See, and that's not... Oh, that's weird. What's that? It's just appeared. Anyway. Stop at location, Brendel passing siding west. Okie dokes. Which presumably means we then back these back down. Right? Yeah, looks like it. Hence our point of. Oh, sorry. Missed it. Hence our point of stopping where we stop. Now, we have to be really careful about moving away here because no doubt it's going to be a massive pain in the neck. And, um,. Uh, we don't want to slip back, do we? No. Why am I no second person? Stop a location, 90 yards. All oh, right, so we don't need to go very far. Okie doke, so let's put a bit of power. 
because you know the fact that we've got gravity on our side doesn't seem to help us a great deal. Wait for it to build up, build up, build up, build up, build up, build up, build up. Come on, you can do it. I think we need more. There we go. Why would it suddenly cut the power? Oh, wrong button. Sorry, my bad. Oh, like a bullet. Look at that. Actually, that worked really well. Well done. Right, we don't go very fast, isn't it? When you're going crazy. But judging by the appalling braking that we had last time, something tells me we'll want to brake fairly early. Go on, we can go a little bit further. It'd be nice to get it slightly more accurate this time. That'll do. Ho oh, oh. ho! I'm not sure I've ever seen one yard, one yard. Rendell Spurt. So I mean, we've got to go back. Oh no! Where do we go then? Is it not appeared yet? Oh right, we've got to go all the way back there. Oh okay. Uh, but we can't. There's train. Oh no, okay. Right, so switch a route and switch a route. Excellent. So reverse it to reverse. Put a power. Because now we don't have gravity on our side, that's not good. Wait for the power to build up. Still, we haven't got as many trucks this time, so cars, whatever they call them. There we go, beautiful. Even decrease the power a little bit. Come on, bro, sorry. Just skim over a little bit so we can get a decent view. Where's our stop point? Oh, okay, fine. Hey, we don't want to get that wrong either, otherwise we'll derail the whole thing. Because I think, although it might seem to imply otherwise, I think that actually needs to be the location of the back of the cars. Well, we'll try it and we'll just gradually ease our way back in and see whether it is or it is not. They're quite short, aren't they? So I think we'd be right to push them right back so we get the loco to that point, I think. He says, famous last words. Sometimes it can be a bit odd about where actually you need the loco to be. Yeah, we haven't got enough space to take them all the way back, have we? I don't think so. get as close as we can, max points and all that. Nah, we're not gonna, we haven't got enough space to get the locos all the way back. No chance. It's a bit weird. That'll do. Good hope. A bit odd, should have brought it straight back in. Ooh. Keep telling myself, don't don't walk down face first. Never walk down the ladder face first. There we go. Right, I was thinking. Spotted and uncoupled, let's pick up the rest of our train again and we can proceed. So what we're gonna do is while we're here 
because we're going to come and do this. Well, I've out, I did a couple of these, say after the last stream. What we got? Freight line information board. Oh, oh yeah. Originally named Crescent, and later Crescent Junction, this place really only exists because of the railroad passing siding. The small yard. The text disappears. Isn't that weird? Oh, there's a bug. Crikey. Seriously. Oh, hang on. Hang on. The small yard. Oh, come on, I want to read it. Small yard sees occasional delivery of fuel tank uh, Well, as we have just done, right? Indeed. Indeed it does. I didn't need to read it because I knew the answer. I just didn't know that I knew the answer. Oh, let's go this way. Close the door. Close that door. There we go. Right. Okay. Forward up to forwards. Or reverse it to forwards. Or reverse it to... Well, you know what I mean. Bit of power. And... Come on. Oh, all right. It's going already. Fair enough. Because there's no trucks to hold it back this time, so it's a bit more sprightly. It'll also stop on a dime, I'm sure. Right, maybe not a dime. Right, so back into Brendel Passing Siding West. Not that traffic should be an issue, because, you know, there's, there's a whole load of cars already parked across the road. Ah. Oh, speeding. Right, can we stop right this time? Might need a little bit more than minimum reduction. Quite a bit more than minimum reduction. Quite a lot more than that. Stop! Stop the train! Jeez. Right, okay. Reverse to reverse. Give me some power. Let's go out and have a look. Oh, hang on, I didn't change the points. Stop, stop, stop. Doofus. My bad. Far too far, okay. That'll do it. Hey, where's the train going? Oi, stop it. Jeez. Seriously. Okay, just behave yourself. Honestly, it's got a mind of its own, this thing. Right, let's go. That was my fault. 100% completely forgot. Right, let's try and get this right for certain. Without smashing into the cars and derailing them or something equally horrendous. There we go, but without stopping before we get there. Thank you very much. It's all a bit delay stuff, you know. It takes a while for the power to kick in. It takes a while for the brakes to kick in. It takes a while for the brakes to release. It just makes the whole thing just a little bit more tricky. Very nice. Let's proceed to the end of the siding. We must wait. Stop it. We must wait for another eastbound train. Okie doke.
A little bit of power on, only got a 10 mile an hour limit, so we need to take it easy. No point in going crazy. You're going to stop in 300 yards, and we know what this thing's like at stopping. Oh, we're quite close to that red signal. Oh my goodness, this could be a disaster. Okay, dokie. 0.7% down bubble. Oh, but we do need to, apparently, gravity's not enough. Oh no, now gravity's decided to take over. Okie doke, that's interesting. Again, physics don't seem quite happy. Accelerometer going up and down. Well, we can go faster, but I don't want to go faster, but thanks. Right, doing 10 miles an hour, we've got 230 yards. I'm going to bring it down a little bit because I'm going to chicken out. Brakes biting? Not really. Now it is. Not much, though. The speed is just, it's jumping all over the place. It's really peculiar. Okay, should be all right now. You release the brakes and suddenly it shoots forward again by two miles an hour. It's not right. Stop! You're on max brake. Seriously, stop. Good grief. Crikey, that was nerve-wracking. Well, we made it anyway. Gold medal. Hmm, but yeah, it just doesn't seem... I noticed a little bit the other day, it seemed quite tricky to keep it at a reasonable speed, but I took that to be just, you know, the constantly changing um, gradients and all that, but mm, it still feels there's something not quite right about it. But anyway, it's done. We got our gold medal. It was kind of fun. So I hope you enjoyed it. We've set out our tank cars, as they say, I think. And uh, yeah, if you did, a like subscription is very much appreciated. And I'll see you on the next one. This is the last of the short scenarios. So this might be a stream thing, or I might do time lapses or take chunks out. I don't know. But I'll have a think about it. What we need to do next is go back to the UK, uh, because actually the current community challenge is... Um, uh, is UK based and uh, therefore to do my contribution I should uh, focus on uh, UK scenarios so we'll do some UK stuff but I hope you enjoyed it as I say if you did like descriptions are very much appreciated any particular UK stuff you want to see let me know and uh, take care of yourselves and I'll look forward to seeing you next time bye for now <laughs>